Hello, hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel, it's Marta here and today we will do, as you can see, ATCs, a set of uh, tiny cards. What is ATC really? Let me just grab my phone and quickly tell you. Artist trading cards began in the tradition of hockey trading cards with a personal artistic twist. There is a specific size to it, which I wrote for you here in centimeters, inches and cells. Tale, uh, I'm not sure in English, and those are really, really uh, uh, little pieces of art, art pieces that you can exchange with other crafters. Uh, it started with the hockey cards, people were exchanging them, uh, and now crafters absolutely love them, and they usually make them in sets of three. But if you, you can make them in sets of two, I have such a mess in this to do, and I couldn't find any that I received uh, in the past years. I found one from Wendy and uh, addition two by two so there were two cards like that artist trading card magical garden artist wendy uh, date when i received it and a beautiful beautiful piece so and packed in a little uh, in a little cellophone, cellophone little paper bag really you can do anything and everything on your atc cards and today i decided to um work on a Back uh, as my base, work on a packaging from uh, in this case, Prem chipboards. And I have pieces here that I haven't used, they are brand new. I purchased them in the past, past months, but I haven't been using them, so I think it's nice to it will be nice to uh, use some uh, uh, things from my stash that I purchased. I wanted to play with it, and uh, due to many million other things, I have never done it. So I have some lovely papers different things and um, this is interesting I have luxury printed acetate sheets with butterflies flutterbys so I'll see let me just let's start what we're gonna start with I believe we should start with uh, as, uh, making sure that we have the right size but in my eyes the size doesn't have to be that perfect but seemingly in the eyes of people who really do trade their ATCs it's very important because they have albums of putting them in the little pockets so it's important for them to be a perfect size but if you want to keep it for yourself make them for yourself you really don't have to stress over a perfect size but let's see uh, in centimeters 8.9 8.9 roughly here and 6 by 6 by 6.3 so a little smaller so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna keep my my I like that um, oh, I know what I'm gonna do actually I know what I'm gonna do I'm such a goose but I will just get rid of that see where is my half and this is what I'm gonna do half my packaging and this is gonna this will be my ATC card because I don't think I'll be exchanging them so I don't mind if they are gonna be a little fatter or maybe a little too fat let's see um that should be 8.9 oops no that this way 8.9 so I'm wow <laughs> that's nine so that's one one millimeter only off so let's do that properly then 6.3 how big 6.3 so really we're talking about a small difference but maybe I will actually maybe this time I will do it properly so 6.3 6.3 let me see here 6.3 uh, this is so strange to cut it. Um, 6.3 is. Where's well, something to write? Some pens. Mm -hmm. 6.3. Mm, so I have two cards now. <laughs> and I'm gonna make a third one, which is gonna be long like this. About. <laughs> About. Mm -hmm. there we go and here mm -hmm. so this will be my base that I will decorate now we, what you could use is you could easily use uh, some really plain cards or some sort of cards like collectible cards if you have but I usually would make them 
the basis myself so really okay that's okay so really it's it's down to your preferences so we have three bases now I'm gonna put those aside um, I have um, the ATC's idea is from um, a lady who commented on my Facebook page because last night I was asking what to do what would be nice to create and a first first reply was ATC sets and I thought wow I haven't done them for a really long so yes lovely idea now I have this interesting set of let me show you paper mania capsule uh, volume and laser cut paper pack interesting not cheap but interesting so I like buying sometimes things that are interesting uh, even though I'm not too sure what I'm gonna use them for but hey look how pretty that is I couldn't resist so this is what we have and there's this volume oh there are different the, the different patterns have a look mm. and they're semi-transparent they look very pretty oh there are different patterns of that as well and this mm, look interesting lovely lovely maybe I will actually swap to this one I think I'll see I'll see I, or maybe I can use both <laughs> uh, I like that I think something different from pa paper mania which is nice sorry for the all the noises all the noises now working on ATC let's face it it's not easy due to the size for some it's absolutely um, impossible to work on it um, absolutely impossible for some it's a perfect size because you don't have to work too long on them you can use things around you and things stuff like that so it's again very Maybe I'll use this one or this one, let me see. Maybe this one. So it's a very personal thing, uh, how you feel about that. Okay, I'm done with I'm done with the noises. But I think it's nice to try to um, try to challenge yourself and try it try it. Now with who could you exchange that that's another question that many of you would be asking. Oh look at that. How cute are those? I love them. Now you could exchange them with a friend of yours that is a crafter and I'm sure we all have crafters and if you don't I encourage you to in to jump in into some Facebook groups um, um I have a Facebook group called Marumi's Creative Cafe. This group was opened very long time ago, uh, well, a year ago. I think we have a year and a half, year and a bit, yeah. I think we have over 15,000 people there, so jump in into Facebook group if you wish uh, to be added. And you can share your, um, your ideas there, you can share your projects there. The group is especially for uh, those who are not a professional crafters that live on craft it's more for those who wish to just be part of a community that share their passion for creating that's really about it so there's not about promotion it's not about who's better who's this uh, it's about enjoying craft what you bought what did you find interesting what did you create and maybe uh, maybe uh, you share projects that were inspired by my videos which is awesome so you can jump in my room is creative cafe let me show you the Facebook and I'll I'll show you uh, the group itself let me just quickly uh, quickly try to find that for you I'm pretty sure I can so Maremi's Maremi's my oh yeah Maremi's creative cafe that's how oh, we have 16,000 how many we have oh it's ha it has the let me just let me just bring that camera to you so you could it's oh oh, oh there you go so it's mm, it's still not right Marimi's Creative Cafe we have over 16,000 uh, members and that's how it is you just scroll down and you see beautiful creations of people all over the world all kinds of crafts and the group is for Ordinary crafters, I like to call it, not those who work for craft companies and wish to promote their products or wish to promote their um, 
their things. It's not for promotional reason group, it's really for support each other. Oh, there is some ATC set from Carol. I hope you don't mind Carol because it's a stunning set of ATCs. Uh, so, you know, if you watercolor, mixed media artist, albums, drawing, painting, you name it, everything is there. So, so yes, really you have plenty things there to scroll and to look uh, and people really it's like a little well not that little but big family and many of you is just uh, sharing all kinds of things even including your personal life and you find the group very supportive so I encourage you to jump in, into it Maramis Creative Cafe uh, oh, there are projects uh, Urlika did projects inspired by my videos uh, and using my printouts actually my stickers as well so that's lovely and yeah, you can find so many things and inspirations in there. You can uh, look for things uh, in the group as well, and you can um, you can just find things in the group within the group. So jump in there. But sorry. Mm. So, um, but the group is not for exchanging ATCs, but you can find uh, other crafters that you can relate to, you may, may, you may make friends, so that's how you do it, you go into those groups and there are groups from, um, of ATCs, are journalers, mixed media, uh, anything, there is loads of groups for paper crafters, my group uh, it's really, it's for those who watch my videos, who are inspired by those videos, who are enjoying craft on a regular basis who are uh, just be, trying to be stay stay creative and enjoy and um, wish to share their love and passion for it with others so that's really it uh, I hope you will enjoy it but enough of chats about something and kind of not related to our video today and I have this beautiful paper here I can hear the little munchkin kind of is awake a little bit so if you will hear a little noise from a little baby that will be our munchkin uh, did I say it? Our munchkin. Okay, I have those beautiful papers from Lemon Craft. And I'm gonna have a bigger one, maybe. I'll see. So I'm trying to, maybe for a change, use something today that I bought but never used. No, actually, the big one is a little too big. It's stunning, it's gorgeous. If any of you wish to have a look, it's Lemon Craft. Oh, I think we are all out of focus. Oh, Lemon Craft. No, I'm gonna. Sk st stick with the smaller piece. Are we still out of focus? We are. Are we? I'm not too sure because it's hard for me to see. But I think we are pretty much. I don't know. No, it's good now. So what I'm gonna do is now I'm gonna try to concentrate which background I'm gonna use. Now I absolutely love and adore the fact that I have my wooden kind of ATCs, my backgrounds. So anything will be pretty. I'm gonna concentrate on some teal colors, I think. So I'm gonna maybe grab the. I'm looking at my. I'm looking at my butterflies here that I have and which would work nicely with it. I have some flowers as well. Let me see. I have some tealish flowers which would be nice to use. Oh, this is nice. So maybe I could grab that and maybe I could grab this. Mm, why not? Why not? Maybe this and what else? Um. Wow, it's funny because I haven't worked uh, on um, strictly on the paper, different than card making for so long, and it feels so strange but so good at the same time. So that's what we have here. We have those papers that I will kind of play around. We have those gorgeous so things that <laughs> too many things and such a small surface. But no, hey, we will do it. I have those lovely. Oh, I can hear my baby, uh, lovely um, lacy flowers, and I'm gonna grab the Baba and bring her here on the little seat. <laughs> okay, the Baba is here with me. <laughs> I need a sip of coffee. <laughs> mm. Yummy coffee. That's a Sikori coffee. I keep on promoting that Sikori coffee, but if you're pregnant or if you're breastfeeding, this is a great substitute for coffee lovers like myself. 
Now, I'm gonna uh, start and I'm not gonna cut. Interesting enough, I will actually just rip it and see what will happen. This would be nice to keep it as it is. I'm gonna try to <clears throat> I'm gonna try to see if I can if I can oh how lovely is that? I am gonna and I'm gonna work on a hot glue today and no mediums for a change. If you will hear uh, toys, uh, Hania is here. She is on her little chair, and she finally now is able to kind of, uh, with uh, knowledge and acknowledgement of what's around, yeah, start touching her toys on the chair, which is nice and making those noises. <laughs> okay, so that could be our first one to start with. And um, now, if you're doing drawing and things like that usually you end up with the ATC being in the frame but I like to hello baby I like to kind of go outside think outside the box and do it a little different I'll show you um, I'll see and you will see what I mean by that <clears throat> I think I like to just you know make it different a little bit I like that I'm gonna leave it for now just to see where we are heading with the with my other, oh maybe I'm gonna skip that since this is uh, the the writing so I'm gonna see where we are heading with this I'm gonna pl put that on the side and we c we have to try what well, not we'd have to but I think it's the best if we try to work simultaneously on the background of all of the three uh, cards so that's what I'm gonna do oops <laughs> can you hear the little toys turning around which is super cute and she's finally understanding and looking at them and trying to touch them and reach for them, which is great. Now, those are the one-sided papers, so um, only one. <laughs> I can hear you, baby. I can hear you, Baba. Now, that will be lovely. That will be lovely. Oh, hello. Now, before I jump in, because I'm afraid I'm going to forget about it nearly, and I'm gonna just see I love that idea I have to say I love that you know why I love that <laughs> because I'm such a lazy crafter I have the die cut machine to you know big shot and all and it's just I, it's just I don't know I have not enough space on the table you should see me today I just push on that side push on that side so I will have enough space just to be off camera that you wouldn't see my messy table and I would just have this inch uh, this inch part for creating uh, on the camera look oh are you okay, Baba? Are you okay, Babinka? Um, so look how cute that is. We're kind of creating dimension now. As I said, typical cards would be probably a little different. They wouldn't be that 3D. Uh, probably at the beginning they wouldn't have mi mixed medias on it. But as the time goes, people add their own touch to it and their own flair. So things change. Oh, look how cute and pretty that is, as it is. I'm going to leave it at that. We need something else on our card number three. And since this one is teal, this one is, um, th this is how I see it. This one is tealish. This one is um, um, beigey. So this one will be mix of beigey and teal, <laughs> if that makes sense to you. Uh, so yes, that's what I'm going to do. I will have both, mix of both, and the third paper I probably won't use. That's okay as well. Now let's see. Mm -hmm. You see? So that's interesting, isn't it? That's interesting. Okay. And also maybe this could be. So as you can tell, all three pieces, and uh, do you know what? I'm going to actually skip that this time because this will, oh, maybe no, maybe I'll leave that. Oh, are you okay? A little cough. Uh, as you can see, three ADCs should be pretty much related to each other. In a color, in a type of things we used. Of course, you can do our opposite to what I say, but if you're starting with your ADCs, you're not too sure what to use and how to play with it. Go with the theme, go with the color, go with the kind of products you similar. As you can tell, we have the same pieces in each three uh, colors. We concentrated teal here, creamy here, and teal and creamy in the third one. So that's kind of where we're heading. Oh, are we? 
Now, I love that. I really wish to use that. I wonder if I can cut it. Oh, that's nice. I think I wish to... Yeah, that's so pretty. That's so pretty. I like that. Mm-hmm. And this somewhere as well should go. I don't know. I like the edges to be ripped usually. That's kind of my my thing. That's what I like. Uh huh. Maybe I'm gonna just make that smaller a little bit so other things can be seen more. I'll see. I will work on this one. That's why I said I'm not too convinced because we could actually maybe just oops go for that kind of thing and have the teal more much more visible mm hmm something like that or yeah or like this no the teal is gone then no maybe like that and like that something like this maybe yeah I like that I'll, I'll leave this one off because because <laughs> Just because um, I have those sets of um, lace and they are in my Etsy store. This is a smaller set with the smaller flowers and this is a bigger one with the bigger flowers and I think one more flower is in and there are some gorgeous leaves as well I'm going to show you. You can head off to see them for yourself in Etsy if you wish but I love them flowers and I think they could work so lovely together. There are three the same flowers and look there are some lovely uh, leaves as well and yeah and I think I'm gonna maybe jump in into adding those somehow I don't know I'm gonna just rip that and see what I can do about it oh yes that looks interesting now. <laughs> Maybe the darker one, actually. And I'm gonna take that off as well. Uh -huh. I wonder how long will I be able to create? <laughs> but the Baba seems to be still happy with the toy. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna show you her in a minute. Let me just finish my my thinking my out loud thinking now we could also add as you can see I don't glue anything yet because I'm trying to work around it and see what I can do and see where this is taking us I'm not too convinced about those those wooden things but that's okay now I have them smaller ones as well those flowers and sorry for that noise and maybe I will have this. What if I'm gonna... I don't know. But... Oh, this one is... Oh, wait. Oh, that's nice. That's lovely. But... We have to remember that we have still left something else, which is... The Aceta... Who is kicking me here? The aceta, acetate, <laughs> acetate little butterflies, which are great to be used. And oh, I took a chipboard as well. Let's see if that will be, if those chipboards would be handy. I have those lovely chipboards from Little Birdie as well. Let me just take it out. A little frame. I'll see how this will be. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Oh, bless your heart. That's probably because it's lots of dust here, isn't it? I'm sorry, baby Inca. <clears throat> How cute is this? Look, I love thinking outside of the box. Maybe it's too much for you. So what I'm going to do is I will... Oh, I have an idea at the end. I'll show you in a minute. Well, no, I'll show you now. <clears throat> I'm going to cut it in half. And I'm going to cut this in half. Mm -hmm. No, I'm going to leave that. And look, since the three ADCs should be pretty much similar, I'm going to have this bit, let's say, here 
which would be nice. Same for, and maybe this one, and the bigger one will be here on that side, and this one will be maybe somewhere here. How cool is this? <laughs> I love that. Do you know, I love exploring. I love to kind of surprise myself. Surprise myself equally. Uh, I think it's time to start gluing that regardless because I, I, in a minute I'm gonna have everything uh, kind of br broken. So I'm gonna start gluing that. I'm gonna start over with my gorgeous of flowers and my hot glue is here. And I hope that the little Baba will allow me to finish that video for you guys. What is this happening today, Hannah? <laughs> Hi, baby. Now, hot glue today only. We're going for a quick fix, <laughs> really. Uh, so I'm using that. <clears throat> a little bit of that, a little bit of that, a little bit of that, maybe. And something like that. Mm-hmm. As you can see, I'm not putting everywhere, uh, you know, here and there, here and there, here and there. I like that things can be, you know, not sticked fully. Now, and I'm gonna probably, uh, I'm gonna just cut that piece element. Uh huh. Now, if you don't have them sheets, of course, you probably don't because you, you can't have everything. If you don't have them, I'm sure you have die cuts, you have some things that you can use. So you use what you have around the house, guys. You don't have to necessarily have this. You can cut it for yourself or use some, um, what you call them, uh, not lace, uh, um, ah, napkin, not napkin, crochet, um, Ah uh, no, a sip of coffee maybe will help. Serviettes, you know what I mean. That's kind of th that kind of thing. Okay, so I'm gonna attach my gorgeous flowers as well, somewhere like that. So what's left is for now. Oh, maybe I can just shaft it in here or something, or like that. No. I loved the idea. I'm gonna leave that so it will be easier for me to attach it. But I like that. Are you okay, Hannah? She's exciting about playing with her toys because she now understands that the toys are her best friends. <laughs> that she can touch and kick and things will shine and make noises and all. So we are at this stage. She is nearly what? Uh, she will be 11 weeks this Friday. No, it's Friday today. So she's 11 weeks today. So that's like nearly three months, which is... Isn't it crazy? We were just pregnant together here, guys, on this channel, chatting about uh, about that, and wow, time is flying. I'm gonna gently just attach it, because I, I pull it too much. So I don't think it's finished. I think we need some title and some butterflies and something, but before I do it, I just will uh, finish off the others, so that way I can basically play around and think for what else to be can be done. I like what I see, so I'm just gonna gently uh, touch a little bit of here, a little bit of there, to make sure I'm not gonna... Hey! Who is a happy baby? Who is a happy baby here? <gasps> That's exciting! Is that the owl here? <gasps> hi! <laughs> hi! Will you say hi to mama? No? You be staring at mama? <laughs> um, do you know what? I wasn't visualizing what I will be with Hannah in the studio or not, but I love that. I love that. I thought I will be... Uh, I think each time she's here, which is th second or third time she's here with me, I think each time she's with me I feel more relaxed. And she's bigger as well, so she's more relaxed probably too. And she's not staring at me and she's not eating her hands with the stress, <laughs> but she's actually um, playing with her toys and now she's kicking me. <laughs> okay, now I have some glue here and I'm thinking where to where to add my... Or maybe this side, since I have the beautiful lace on that on here. Oh, Hannah, how Hannah, Hannah. 
I think so. I think so. So hot glue. Don't burn yourself. Be very careful with hot glue gun. Okay? Please promise me that. Now those are gorgeous chipboards. I love them because they are perfect for mixed media because they are primed. They are gessoed already. Can you imagine? Have I did, did I show you them? I'll show you them. Um they are primed chipboards, no gesso required for priming, they are from Little Birdie. They have gorgeous designs, I've used them in previous videos as well, you, you've seen them before. I love them. Now, uh, I love them and I think uh, they are different style which I like to change, you know me. Uh, you cannot believe it, she's kicking me madly, probably trying, Hannah, she's trying to, f trying her attention, grab attention from me. Hannah, I see you. <laughs> I see you. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get rid of that. Yeah, that's better now. And my flower could go somewhere there. Mm hmm, I think so. And then the third one is left. Uh, so, thank you so much for the ATC idea. So yes, on my Facebook I've asked you what would you like to see and ATC's idea is from Belinda actually. Belinda says maybe as ATC's and I posted this project yesterday which is, do you know what, it's a little bit like a size of ATC's nearly because it's a very small thing created on a cassette, no mediums five minutes literally five minutes i put things together uh, because i was uh, i'm trying to tidy up my workshop which is not happening and when lucas came in uh the other day and he saw the baby in here she, he said do you know what you barely can see the baby among this mess so yeah it's really bad the floor is bad uh, all, all you're missing is like um i don't know the baby, yeah. <laughs> so, um, I posted that asking you what would you like to see and you gave me the inspiration for ATCs. But I, it just clicked to my head that I haven't shown you my online class, which is kind of is going steampunkish way like this. Um, this was released a couple weeks ago only and thank you for those who already got the glass. If you would like to take a class with me and you wish to make a heart like that you can visit my Etsy store because the kit for it with all the bits and pieces, mediums, paints, um, um, gels, gessos, papers, embellishments, everything is in the kit included and this one is affordable kit um, plus shipping, you have to add shipping as well. Uh, I'm not too sure if it's around 10 euro shipping or something. So if you would like to create this heart, if you're into steampunk, if you wish to work on black gesso, have a, have a look at it. And yeah, sidetracked as well, as always. And let's go back to our ATCs at this moment because this is pretty, pretty enjoyable, I have to say. Now those are glued down, are they? Yeah. Now I'm looking where to place my other third element because it would be nice if, um, for example, if I could have, yeah, maybe, no, on this side would be nice, on this side. So I'm trying to make them a little different so if this is like that this is like that this could be like that and it's awesome yeah that's what i'll do so instead of having so this chipboard is here this is in the middle this could be on oh i hear you hannah like this maybe or yeah could be like that why not and the flowers well could be maybe in the middle or I'll see. I'll see how this will be. But you can tell that I'm trying to kind of make them matching uh, lovely together, all three. Uh, so I'm trying to think how to, what to, uh, that's nice, what to use and how to use with it and where to place my elements. Sometimes I can't concentrate what I'm talking because the little one is kicking me. <laughs> The little kicker, little baby pink eye is kicking me now. That's nice. Oh, I'm gonna glue that first, maybe. Um, so, yes, ATCs are great if you wish to exchange something small with another crafter, a little happy mail to be sent. If you have a friend crafter, or if you don't, it's time to look for one. It's time to become a part of community where you can try and look for a, a friend, a crafty body. 
and I know that in my group, my Rem's Creative Cafe, I know that many, many of you joined. I forgot to mention to you about the group for the past months, uh, um, but yes, the group is there. And I know that many, many of you joined, many of you found a pal that you write letters with or exchange um, happy mails from your own countries because that's interesting. ATC is, is nice size as well because it's not that expensive to ship it, you know. Or you have to always look at the shipping cost to other countries and things like that. But yes, um, the group itself, it's not really designed for people to, to, um, it's not for people to join and to exchange things, no, but it's just an idea for you to understand how things work and how the community of crafter, crafters work, especially if you're not in the community. So you feel free to join my group, share your projects there, share your inspirations, your everyday life. If you have some worries, you can chat to people. And there are plenty of us who can reply and we just share happiness and uh, and sad moments, everything together in there. Okay. Oh, bless you, baby. <laughs> you know the little smile that you get? I can see you, Hanya. Yeah, I can see you clearly. Now, what about this little, those little, uh, those butterflies? They're transparent butterflies. I'm really tempted to use them as well. Now the Henio is chatting. <laughs> <clears throat> the whole house of little creatures is chatting and calling. So, okay. Let's see if this is, like, I got those. Uh, I'm not, I wasn't too sure what I'm going to do with it. I wasn't sure if I'd be loving it, but I said I have to get it. And again, that wasn't the cheapest product to get, but I think you get so many sheets in the pack that it's worth it. The only thing is I think all of the, sh the butterflies are exactly the same. So having so many pages, sheets with so many the same butterflies, do you know what? I'm gonna check it because maybe I'm I'm not right. Right? Maybe this is wrong. What I'm saying. But from the quick look, <clears throat> it looked. To, yeah, look, it's all the same. So that's a pity. That's a pity. That's a little shame that you could have like a transparent flower, so you could have transparent bubbles. Anything. Do you know? I would love to do that. So. And there we go. I think this could be pretty nice and I worked with the transparent cassette yesterday as, and as I show you again the cassette was transparent so it was lovely the photograph was lovely that some bits were you know like hanging on nothing which was interesting to see now I'm very delicate with it because I used only hot glue gun and hot glue you know yourself for sticking heavy objects is not the best <laughs> a little kicking I can see you I can see you. Yeah? Yes! Um, so gel medium would be better if you wish to keep it forever. I just had this urge calling for creating and I just said I'll do that even with the hot glue just just quickly. It looked lovely. Now I love what I see at this moment. Oh, look. That's so nice. So pretty. So yes, the, the butterfly works lovely. Let me just think where to put, even like to hiding, oh, I absolutely adore that now. Oh yes, this is the perfect place for that butterfly. So I'm gonna just, ah, oh, look how cool, cool, cool is that. Now we need a little glue there. <clears throat> it's so funny because I purchased those butterflies and those things like in the past months and uh, I wasn't creating that many things and things were waiting they were waiting for the perfect moment look what an interesting ATC again the very proper ATC <laughs> is like Wendy's the gorgeous work with mediums and things and various tr you know it's it's the in the in the shape my one is very much not but again, I love thinking outside of the box. I love be different. I love things uh, to be challenging for me. So that's what I did. And I'm gonna maybe grab another butterfly. And this one maybe. Absolutely love those butterflies. If you be asking, I'm gonna tell you because I know you be asking probably. It's from Sarah Davies signature collection flutter by collection luxury printed at a what brand is that 
the brand is Crafters Companion. Crafters Companion UK, Crafters Companion, Crafters Companion UK, Crafters Companion, there you go, there you go, so you have to have a look at them, she did lovely other things, I bought this and I'll show you, I, but it's so massive, a, a beautiful butterfly that I hope to use as well, a stamp and a die cut, but yeah, <laughs> I will eventually, I will eventually, but Crafters Companion, they have a lovely selection of stuff, uh, absolutely gorgeous thing so have a look if you wish um now let me finish my ATCs before the little baba gets so hungry and she be nervous getting nervous i'd say but now hi hi baba hi babinka uh what else <gasps> i see you I see you now maybe the big one as well I love that oh no maybe actually the small well no the big one go for big we have 10 pages maybe better that we have so many like I love butterflies you can use them on any project literally they, they would match your cards layouts anything even journal books journal pages any, any anything so of course you can just use it anywhere everywhere so maybe it's better that we have 10 pages of those because if we had one I would cry my eyes off that the one is only one and you know I love butterflies and you could use them everywhere so maybe better that there's 10 of the same pages perfect for hoarders I guess like myself now I'm not super precise with co <laughs> she's kicking me this is so funny Anya hello la hello <laughs> I wonder if you can hear her because she's on the floor this time so I wonder if from far it's the camera catching the noise of her the voice of her noise of her now I lost my transparent oh it's here a, a transparent butterfly you probably don't see much with <laughs> on the white table as well <clears throat> Yes, I think we can nearly call the project finished, but I wish for some, maybe, some words, titles, some encouragement things, so maybe I grab some stickers, some words, stickers, I don't know, we'll see. Ah, there we go. Now, since this is transparent, <laughs> it's, I barely can see. I, there we go, I have it. And in the bin, there we go. Okay, now, so those are no good this time. <clears throat> let me see so this one let me just move, move that this one this one and this one mm -hmm. I think oh this is so stunning look at that I love 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 it absolutely love it and what about this no this here as well mm-hmm yeah that's perfect I'm just gonna glue this down and hide it a little bit where my flower is and here probably hot glue is not the best choice for the transparent butterfly but I hid it enough I like that I love that actually it's not like I love that it's so delicate it's very romantic it's very summery very very delicate yes oh someone suggested as well summery ATCs on my Facebook so I hope this is this is kind of going that that direction I love that imagine this hanging on the darker wall <clears throat> oh bless your heart babinka <laughs> hi <laughs> hi hello <laughs> that's a happy baby are you I think so. Okay, the titles. I have some stickers. Those are Seven Dot Studio. You make me happy, and I like that. And what I wish to do, I'll show you what I wish to do. I'm gonna grab glue here, glue here, and instead of going flat with it, I hope to have this kind of like this, maybe. Yeah. Ah, oh, there we go. <laughs> So it's like a little <coughs> raised, little raised, uh-huh, 
and what else is nice uh, you make me happy life is good yes life is good and I'm gonna do similar thing now but maybe I'm gonna start with one element two <coughs> and then another one oh, too much glue that's okay let's see if I can just do it ah, there we go it's not straight that's okay oh now life is good oh a little hiccup from baby you make me happy life is good and what else sharing our love for life mm. I kind of oh well, maybe here actually maybe here okay I'm nearly done baby mommy is nearly done oh. okay and voila <laughs> you the perfect moment to 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 call mommy because mommy is done and that's that let me just bring the camera closer so you can see it and put the glue away and everything how how this could be where and the, this one in the middle maybe this one like that oh that's cute that's cute indeed let's see if I can bring camera closer and if this is sharp enough is all the uh, uh, uh. there we go so this is how it looks our tiny beauty our ATC no mediums use really just a hot glue a quick fix, quick, quick uh, making. Hi, I can see you. And I'm gonna feed you in a minute now, baby, when mommy's finished. Oh. Okay, guys, I will wrap up at that since mama is, is called down. <laughs> I hope you enjoy that. I hope you have a, had a good morning with me. And uh, I hope this was inspirational, so feel free to join Marami's Creative Cafe if you wish to share your makes inspired by my videos, if you wish to be in the community just of uh, happiness and sharing uh, love for creating, so jump in there on Facebook page and don't be stressed if you're not accepted, uh, send a request and don't be stressed if you're not accepted because we get loads, uh, invite, uh, loads uh, requests daily. I'm gonna take the Baba out, two seconds. Come on, come on, oh, there we go, now I can finish, I have the little Baba here. <laughs> so uh, we get loads of uh, requests a day, so please don't be stressed if you uh, if you won't be accepted straight away, because it takes time. There's few moderators in the group, but uh, we go through uh, everyone, and um, I hope you will you will uh, be patient and you will join us and share your. There's no links allowed. That's uh, one of the important rules because we try try to keep that positive and uh, no kind of trying to keep it that the promotion of yourself is not the priority, but actually sharing love and. Um, being kind for each other in the group, being supportive for each other. This is the ethos of the group, so this is the most important. You can read the group rules when you join the group. They are there in the group, so have a have a look. And what else? Oh yes, and if you wish to have a check of the uh, of the online class with the kit, uh, the tiny love on my Etsy, feel free to do so. And there's few bits and pieces that you may be interested in. So, uh, and that's it. This is the this is the nappy here. <laughs> <laughs> and the little dodos of my baby Inka. So I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna say bye with the little baby Inka. Show me your handy baby Inka. Say bye to everyone. <laughs> and I'm gonna uh, say thank you. Send you massive hugs and loves and kisses and talk, chat to you. Uh, hi, hello, <laughs> chat to you super soon. Thank you for your time and being uh, for being here. Bye till the next time. Love you. Bye.